Wong Siu Ti. I'm the founder and the CEO of the Bonin Sun Bear Conservation Center. I'm right now at the Bonin Sun Bear Conservation Center with many bears in my background. Uh, I want to take this opportunity to thank KL Fairview International School for your help to help us do a lot of work like producing this beautiful art painting of the sun bears and also make that little uh, clay toy uh, for us to sell and raise fund. Thank you very much. Your help has been very, very important and has been very, very helpful for us over the years. And I hope that this relationship will continue and you can continue to help us to do a lot more things to help raise awareness, to raise fundings, and together we can bring a better future for the Sun Bear. Hello everyone, I'm Ashley from Fairview International School and I'm here making this video to explain to you why I wanted to join this event. So I wanted to join this gallery because I was able to enjoy myself as well as help the sun bears. So I was able to enjoy myself as I could de-stress from all my assessments and homework from school. 
and because of this, I really enjoyed myself. So that's all. Hi, my name is Eloise Hoani from Fairview International School Penang. To help all the animals, we should be able to take care of the environment by stopping, stop cutting down trees and stop polluting the environment. My work is about a cat in the tangle art. It uses a wide range of different colors and I drew a cat because it's about animals and the convention is about animals. Hi, my name is Erin. I'm from the Penang campus and I am from grade 7. So these two are my artworks from which I did. So this is my first attempt on the campus. So I basically, I basically like to draw animals because I'm not good in human or those realistic drawings because I am not into those things. So I draw animals because I like animals. I have a nice interest in them. So yeah, so this is my, this is the, the both of these are drawn in poster color, but then I use a watered color. Hi, my name is Yushi. I'm from Penang campus and I'm currently in grade 11. So uh, these artworks are for the are going into an art exhibition which is for the Sun Bear organization. This is, this is to help them raise money for Sun Bears and yeah, to see where everyone wants to buy these paintings and artworks. Uh, I painted these works because I just because it was for the exhibition and I wanted to do some good. My name is Tumi Lee, I'm from Fairview Campus and I'm currently in grade 11. I'm well aware that there is this fundraising program for sun bears and it's, to me I think it's very important that we help to raise funds for animals because animals, that they themselves don't have a voice. So we help to raise a voice for them. We are the voice for the animals and so I think it's some sort of like our responsibility and it's our role to protect them in the first place because we are taking their habitats, we are taking what they have so I think it's just reasonable for us to help them out. So in MYP, IB MYP, we learn many ways to create our artworks and one of the main things I've learned is to express myself in my own way and this is my these are my creations that all shows a part of self-expression is a place. Art is to express our own feelings and express and tell society what each of us can be related to. Like for example, this artwork, this, this shows an imperfect human being. The boat is you, you're never perfect, but we always try to improve ourselves to make sure that we are. And we always strive for a bright future and no matter how dark our current situation situation is we always go for a bright side and this is some sort of influence by the Jainism I guess there are so many different elements so many different types that does not really fit together like logically it's impossible to find a self arrangement and something we learn in IB as well IB MRP is yeah. and this is a eye of a human but fitted into a face of an eagle or a hawk depending on how you see it. So, I choose red because it's some sort of like a fighting color because this is a picture that is a fight for freedom. Something like we as human beings, we always want to be like the birds. We want to be free. We want to have a very free will, go all over the place, travel around the world. And this is what my intention, because this is the intention of this artwork itself, to be free, to fight for freedom. And this is basically, if you just see it plainly, it seems like the world is dying and it's a result of destruction, deforestation. But if you think in expression, expressing yourself internal, like emotion-wise, it's like, it's a very, very dark situation. You are facing a very, very big destruction of maybe, I don't know, if someone close to you died. And like, even something as simple as a flower, so simple and so fragile can light up your whole world. It's just as simple as that. This could be like your child or anyone close to you. Someone just so small can light up your life. So this is basically what I, what I like to do. Hi there, my name is Jason and I would like to share a story about me. I love to draw. Since young, I had, 
I had served as a platform for me to express myself. I remember when I was younger, I had difficulty communicating my needs to people. Hence, my parents encouraged me to pick up drawing to identify my needs and my true feelings. When I became older, I developed a passion towards art, even more especially abstract art. That amazed me. This is where I feel my full potential is limitless. When I draw, I bring the world closer to me and all things surrounding me becomes alive. I used to be a pessimistic child and through art, I see the color of life and its vibrancy. Art is my life. Art is my soul. And I urge all parents to give your kids the opportunity to open their minds creatively and find their true self. Hello, my name is Sophie Chua. I am a pet artist as well as a racing artist. This is for one of my racing art and uh, I painted a sea turtle. And as you can see, here there are several pieces of uh, work that I have done in different bowls. And this is a red cap goldfish and then this is the celestial eye streams and this is a family of streams here I have a beautiful black goldfish in a wine glass I also have miniature teacup sets with rancho fish and this is a orange and black rancho this is a calico rancho. Racing art is a step-by-step -step process and um, a good racing artwork takes about um, a week or more to create because of the racing that need to be cured overnight and um, several layers of painting and racing are required to do a good 3D racing artwork. Some of the racing art that I have created um, actually wow a lot of people because they, they say, oh my goodness, this is so real. And um, some may even say that, uh, no, this is kind of cruel. Put a real uh, tortoise, uh, tortoise inside the racing to create an artwork. But I assure them that, uh, you know, no, no living creatures were hurt in the making of Racine's art.